guys, it's Sweetie Pie. Welcome back with another declutter. We're doing primers and setting sprays today. Um, if you guys did not see my previous declutter, which is the first one I did, then I will link it up above so you guys can go check it out. And yeah, let's just get right into this declutter. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my videos and like this video if you enjoyed it All as well. All right, guys, so we've got primers and setting mists here, okay? So I don't really have a ton of setting mists and primers, but there are definitely some in this pile that I see that I do not want anymore. I also have some eyeshadow primers in here, like just the regular bases, not like um, chubby sticks or anything like that. That'll come like probably next. All right, so um, uh, let's see here. Okay, so the cover, cover effects illuminating setting spray I'm keeping, this hard candy long wear I'm keeping, um, let's see, the essence I'm keeping, I just got that. Uh, this one is an e.l.f. primer mist, and nobody likes it when they spray it on their face, but I'm telling you, spray it on your beauty blender, it's absolutely beautiful, and it does get a little bit tacky, and I do think it does help your foundation to stay on longer. It does not fill pores, so you can put like a pore minimizing primer on top of it, but uh, I strongly suggest this as a primer, uh, a cheap primer. Uh, this one is the e.l.f. Mineral Mist. I actually don't mind this, but it did start to leak a little bit, so I think I'm just going to get rid of this. Uh, this is really awesome, and I think I'm almost out of this. Um, this is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Marine Boosting Mist. Love this. Definitely going to use that up. Uh, my Urban Decay, <laughs> Urban Decay, Urban Decay Setting Mist. Definitely going to keep that. Um, my e.l.f. Setting Mist. Going to keep that. Uh, is there any more setting mists? Did I ch oh, oh, this LA girl, I'm going to throw that away as well. There isn't much left in that bottle, and I think that is that for setting mists. Oh, I have this teeny tiny little Smashbox photo finish. Um, this is their primer water. I'm just going to keep that. You know, I have a little bit left in it. I could probably take it to the wedding I'm going to. Um, all right then. So then the rest of it is just primers. Uh, obviously I'm going to keep this hard candy. I just got that. I'm doing, um, like a haul video with this in it. And I do talk about that. Um, I'm going to keep the e.l.f. Blemish Control Face Primer, and I'm also going to keep the e.l.f. Illuminating Face Primer. One primer that I am going to get rid of that I do not like at all is the Hydrating Face Primer. This comes out so oily. It's just super, super, super oily to me, and I'm just not into it. So I'm going to give that away. I'm actually going to switch lids so that she doesn't get a broken lid when she gets it. Um, okay, uh, the Ordinary Their Face Primer. I'm still working on what I think about this, so I'm definitely going to keep that. Uh, Smashbox Regular Primer, keeping that. The Smashbox Pore Minimizing, keeping that. Um, let's see here. I have the Foundation Primer Laura Mercier Radiance, keeping that. YSL uh, Touche Eclair Blur Primer, keeping that. Professional, definitely keeping that. Uh, the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser, um, I think I'm going to keep that. LA Girl Pro Prep, keeping this. Um, let's see here. Ooh. Uh, this Mariposa Primer, I'm just going to get rid of that. I really don't particularly like it. Um, the Too Faced Shadow Insurance, um, I'm going to keep this. I do not particularly like it, though. Um, I'm still kind of like using it and trying to like it. Uh, primer, this is the hard candy primer, I'm gonna throw that away. Uh, this Tarte Brazilian Plus, I'm gonna throw that away. I don't even know what that is doing in here. Uh, these two AOA primers, um, I'm actually, I'm going to keep, ooh, you know what, I'm going to keep both of them. I'm gonna use them for a little bit. I don't really like either of them, to be honest. The green one is kind of nice because it is tacky, but other than that, I'm not really loving it. Uh, this foundation, uh, Laura Mercier Blemish Control. I honestly don't think there's much left in this. Oh, okay, well there was a tiny bit, but I am just going to throw it away. There isn't much left. Okay, um, this e.l.f. Uh, lock and seal. Oh, I'm going to keep this, but I have not been using this very often. And honestly, all this is is like a setting spray in a tiny little bottle. So actually, you know what? This L.A. girl is actually empty. I'm going to pour 
this entire little bottle. into here and that's how you do that so there we go so yeah I'm gonna keep that now um, my two essence um, ones I'm gonna keep uh, I love this one um, live loves makeup you uh, recommended this and I finally got my hands on it this is the master prime by Maybelline really good really good primer and then I have the smashbox I'm also going to keep all right guys well that is my primers I'm really not getting rid of much um I have what just a few little things that I'm getting rid of the elf mineral mist uh the elf hydrating mist uh Mariposa primer Laura Mercier primer uh Tarte Brazilian plus and then a couple empties and yeah, that's about it. All right, thank you for watching. All right guys, so yeah, that was my primer and setting spray declutter. Didn't really get rid of that much, honestly. I really like, primers are something that I've been trying so hard to find the one that is good for me. So yeah guys, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you didn't already, and like this video if you enjoyed it, and comment down below what is your favorite primer. I want to buy some more. So yeah guys, I love you. Have a good day.